So on the people that haven't mastered the bolo, there's always a very easy footlock you can get on them where, go ahead. The people that do the bolo extremely well, their foot is hidden, they control your hips, and you don't get the chance to do this. But this isn't one of those niche cases which most people suck at bolos that you can do to most people. So when they're going underneath, I'm watching this leg. If this has any space at all, I can footlock them. When this is jammed into you, even then you can, but it depends on their control of their hips. So right here, I feel their space. This knee is coming through. I'm gonna jump myself across. Same time, I try and clear this a little bit. My foot on this way takes one big step over. Other side. So I'm watching this leg right now. I can feel it coming up, stepping over, jamming this knee through. Now I have the foot lock up here. So as he's coming underneath, if my knee can go through, I can go for this foot lock at any time. Even if he's doing a lot better job keeping this in and inverting more, I can still just slide this up and just put my foot in here to start attacking the foot lock. It's the guys that have really good control over your hips that I won't go for this on. Because if you hesitate at all for trying to deal with their bolo, you're getting boloed.